approach shots. It's pretty common, but it's very neglected. Most of your approach shots, if you watch the best players, approach down the line. It's not illegal. You can approach cross court, but there has to be a rhyme and reason. If you're going to approach cross court, make sure it's a winning shot. Make sure it's a forcing shot. Or strategically, if someone just has such a weak forehand, very weak, or a weak backhand, depending on which side you're attacking, then that's okay to go into that side. But remember, when you approach like that, you don't have the ball in front of you. The next shot is not in front of you. You have to cover a lot more real estate. A high percentage, way in the 80%, maybe 90 on the pro tour. Watch where the approaches go. Day in and day out, week in and week out on the tour, they approach down the line. And here's the reason why. They're approaching down the line, whether they're chipping or they're ripping, whatever they're doing, they're approaching down the line. A, they're hitting the ball in a straight line. It's going to get there quicker. Number two, now that you've hit the ball down the line, the ball is now in front of you. You've positioned yourself properly for the next shot. So once you come in and you get out of your split, you got the down the line covered. Most of the time, they're going to go with a cross court pass. So mentally, the anticipation should be, I'm sitting on the cross court pass, but I've got the down the line covered. So the strategic advice we want the approach shots down the line.